Hey, Hillbilly Nation. This is American Hillbilly. <laughs> oh, man, I hope you're having a wonderful day today. Oh, I wanted to come do a little short video with you guys. Yeah, I experienced something that I thought, well, I'm just going ahead and share this, okay? So as you guys probably already know if you've been watching my channel, I grew up with a little Ifka single shot lever action. 22 right here, yeah. And I ended up losing it, um, got stolen or whatever. I never did find out where it went or what happened. So I was able to get another one. <laughs> yeah, and I was so excited about it. Well, I got this and, you know, got it in and it's in good shape, everything. It shot good. Um, I put first few rounds in it and when I went to eject it, it's empty here, nothing in there. I went to eject it, the shell wouldn't come out. And they're like, oh man, you know, that kind of stinks. And so I had uh, talked to one of my friends, uh, Jamie, JH586, and he still has his from when he was young. And he said the ejector got wore out and just wouldn't kick the shells out. So I thought, well, that's what the problem is with this one, okay? So I'd shoot it and then I would have to dig the the empty shell, the spent shell out of the chamber, you know, and then put another one in, which is totally safe. I mean, because it is a single shot, you know, that, sh that shell has to come out before another one can go in. So, you know, not a big deal, kind of a letdown. I actually was in the process of trying to find like a gunsmith or something, see if they could fix it. And what I've been doing is I was just shooting some of this browning ammo here I picked up on sale. Um, I buy a lot of ammo sometimes that's bulk. Uh, most of them don't have any trouble with it. Especially in a 22, not too bad. So this is what I was shooting to. I want to show you here what uh, happened. So I'm going to load one up here. Put my eye protection on. Okay. So I have one loaded up here. And it's totally safe. The hammer's not cocked. So I've not fired it. I'm gonna eject it here. Up there, finally, okay. So let me grab this. So it's unfired. So it will eject them if you don't shoot them. So I thought, well, I don't know. It, it, I mean, I love the gun, sentimental, you know. So, you know, I thought, what the heck? So anyway, let me go ahead and just fire one right here uh, real quick, and I'll show you what happens after I shoot it. Uh, oh, there's a grape crush bottle hanging down there. I'll just shoot it. Okay. So it will not eject. I have to physically pull the bullet out. It's pretty tight getting out of there, okay? So when I come out to the video the other day, I just happened to grab a different box of ammo. Wasn't even thinking, this is just some Federal right here. Uh, the Browning's 36 grain, this is 40 grain, which this being uh, not being automatic, it shouldn't really matter. So I'm gonna load up some Federal in here and this is where I found what the difference was. That goes in there, no problem. I'm gonna fire one down here. Okay, see that? Came right out, no problem. So let me try another one. Okay, so I have another Federal loaded up here. All right, see, ejected just fine. So the reason I'm doing this, it's not to hate on a certain ammo or nothing. Uh, most usually, if something runs, you know, certain brand of ammo, it don't matter to me. Uh, I'm not really picky, so I'm not trying to hate on browning or anything, but I was about to take this gun in and spend a bunch of money trying to get it fixed when there's nothing wrong with it. <laughs> yeah. So, um, as long as I don't run that ammo in it, um, 
it's it's running just fine <laughs> so anyway i just wanted to share this with you guys just in case you run into something like that okay <laughs> anyway don't forget this saturday night the 16th at 9 central 10 o'clock eastern we're gonna be having guns beer and therapy and we're having a big giveaway there yeah so i hit uh 1000 subscribers in one year that was the goal i had set and thanks to hillbilly nation i made it i thank you guys so much i love you um so we're gonna be having some wonderful giveaways so make sure you make it to guns beer and therapy right here on this channel saturday night nine o'clock central ten o'clock eastern and there's even a bunch more giveaways bubba is going to jump on but he's mostly on there anyway he's doing a giveaway for his 250 subs all right congratulations bubba so you're not going to miss this show it's going to be a lot of fun we had some other people friends of the channel they're going to be on there they're going to be giving stuff away it's just going to be a fun night you're not going to want to miss it remember god family and country and make somebody's day better will you and if the good lord's willing the creeks don't rise i'll be seeing you again hillbilly nation i love you Ready? <laughs> Look at that face! One less can of hard seltzer in this world. I'm proud of myself.